off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Welcome to our morning. I didn't end officially last night because this one had an allergy attack the entire two hour drive from Boise to Twin Falls. Got home, or got here to the hotel, got some medicine at the gas station next door. Um, we are at the Sleep Inn. Why well, hasn't everyone ever, ever thought of that name for a, a hotel before now? Anyway, we, he took the medicine <laughs> right away. We both took showers, hopped into bed. He was asleep within 10 minutes. So. A little magic man. <laughs> yes. Um, I can get the door and then I'll hand the. I got this. Uh, I just have to get. You just have to get. So, anyway, we slept good. Then I was sick a very large majority of the night. Um, I'm, I'm feeling better now, but uh, it's not pleasant, so I haven't had breakfast. Um, but he did. He went and ate while I, I think so. I'll go do a quick, this is our room. It's very small, but it was a hundred bucks. So gave us a good night, good place to sleep. But now we're gonna check out and head to my dad's house, even though he's not there. He is doing the Bite the Bear. It's a marathon, not a marathon, but it's like a race. Hang on. All right, I couldn't manage all the stuff in my hands. so. My dad, um, for years, has done um, the medical side of marathons, half marathons, bike the bear, um, I'll explain that one in a second. So he'll do little pit stops, um, and he'll be like one of the medical tents or whatever. Now he doesn't have his license anymore because he's retired, um, so he does ham radio. <laughs> and he goes out into like the more obscure areas where they don't have good reception and does um, turn right on to South Centennial Spur. and does ham radio calls um, between him and other stations and stuff to keep communication open um, in these remote areas where they do. Yeah, it's pretty remote up in the mountains. Yeah, so he's doing that tomorrow for the, right today. Oh, goodness sakes, this isn't working out so well. <laughs> he's doing that today for the Bike the Bear, which if you remember every summer when we go um, Every summer when we go to, hang on, goodness, I can't keep things in control. Everything was like spilling and the sun was in my eyes. And anyway, every summer you guys have seen us go to Bear Lake and we rent a house and we spend time with my family. So that's Bear Lake. And the bike, the bear is going from Bear Lake down through the canyon back to the valley where I grew up in. And it's quite, quite the race. And so that's where my dad is leading up until right after the baby shower today and then we're having dinner at his house So he won't be there when we first get there, which he <laughs> he felt so bad. I'm like dad I'm, I'm literally just gonna be getting um, baby shower stuff ready to go. So We're gonna go and do that. We have a two hour two and a half hour drive um, To get to my dad's and then we've got errands to run and get ready for the shower um, my sister is actually working this morning until about 10 o'clock. She has a telehealth job for now. She's gonna start at her permanent nurse practitionership position um, very soon. So she had to finish this shift today and then she's gonna drive down with her husband, with Josh, and meet us down there. I'm pretty sure my twin sister is already there. In fact, I should call her and see if she's already at my dad's. So. I'm surprised she didn't call last night telling us that she was there. She was gonna go up last night. But we are gonna have a fun day. Okay, I'm kinda of getting stressed because this charging station, is we're like in three, three times slower than all the rest we've gone to. The other yeah. ones were charging at 600 kilowatts an hour. This one's doing 200. It's taking forever. And, um,. Yeah, this is one of the slowest. And so now I'm, I don't even know we, if I'm gonna we make it in time. Be done by now. Because not only do I have to get there and just, oh, she's at my dad's, okay. So I'm gonna talk to my, my twin sister. She's at my dad's house getting ready. I'm gonna have to have her go and get um, the balloons at the dollar store and possibly even the diapers and I'll Venmo her for my part of it because we're gonna get there an hour before I need to be at Olive Garden, but we still have to charge again when we get there. 
a half hour outside of town. Because <sighs> there's no major charging stations in, in my hometown. The entire valley. Yeah, there's no there's no superchargers, and the only one that we found was at a hotel, and it would have taken like two hours to do like forty percent or something like that. Yeah, it's like a, it's one of my charger at home is faster than what they have. I don't know why. So anyway, we still have a twenty minutes on a what was it a 40 minute charge here so now i'm gonna go and get all my gifts out of the back and start putting them in the packages and or in the gift bags and get them all prepped and just line them on the back seat here um and then i'm gonna call my sister and like see what we can do to like get this going here faster she's gonna have to help on her end and go and pick up the stuff i thought i had time to go and do because my other sister she has to work for another half hour and then they have to drive there so <sighs> all right we have enough charge to go now we've got stuff in the gift bags i'm gonna wait and put the fluff tissue in it when we get there um and then i have two extra bags to put the diapers and wipes in when aaron and my sister buys them from costco so i just called my twin sister she's at my dad's house she got there last night and so or maybe she got there this morning i don't know so she is going to run to costco for me and get the diapers and wipes there's a whole bunch of us that are gonna to go together on, on that. And then she's gonna to run to the dollar store and get all the balloons for me. And she's like, and just so you know, when I start working on balloons, I kind of go overboard and I buy too many. So that, that, that will be on me. I'll buy the extras. Cause <laughs> so she's gonna do that for me. My other sister has all the desserts at my dad's house already. She delivered them last night, which is fantastic. And then, um, now turn right on to meals and what just slid place. back there? I think we're gonna be fine. When I get there, um, I think we'll have just enough time. Okay, that's not gonna work. Can you now go into the roundabout and okay. take the second? I can show feet. We'll put the chickens on. I can show feet. Like, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Three, two, one, and you gotta move. You gotta move. You gotta move. Go! <laughs> Josie, you gotta move. Or uh, Nora, you gotta move. 
Get him, Remy. <laughs> if you're touched, you're out. All right, so as I knew probably would happen, and it did happen yesterday, it is fast forward, the next day, um, I had an absolute blast with my family at my sister's baby shower, and then we quickly went to my dad's house, and the party just started all over again at my dad's house, um, and we, we were up with my aunts, and my brother, and my sister, Reason until you. And me. <laughs> you went to bed at like, what, 11? No, it was midnight or something. I, you, I mean, you didn't go to bed at midnight. I, I came up at 12.30. wandering around. Oh, you were? Yeah. Oh, you were. I My aunts didn't go home until 12 or 12.30. You have to remember, my aunts are in their 70s. <laughs> they were like, why are we up this late? We can't do this. Our bodies don't work this way. But we just had such a good time talking, and I got a chance to talk to my cousin and my aunts, and two of my cousins and my aunts, and and even my brothers. Um, we're gonna have more chance to talk to my brothers tonight. We're gonna go out to his house. But it was just so much fun, and I just, I didn't pick up the camera, because I was just so involved with like talking with everyone and having a good time. I did get little snippets of the food that I will quickly show you, and then, um, while I got all the kids set up to play the chicken um, tag game, um, they all ran outside to go play it, and I got distracted talking to someone else, and I missed their whole first round of playing the game, and so I had to quickly ask them to play it again. It wasn't as cute as I think it was the first time that they played it, and the grass was cold and wet when we went and played it the second time. So they just, they were cold, their feet were cold. And so, um, but they had fun playing it. They thought it was great. None of the adults would play. <laughs> they didn't want to have anything to do with it. They're like, we're not gonna be out there humiliating, humiliating ourselves. Um, but, we're, so we're just gonna continue today. And we're, um, even though it is Sunday, um, we are out of town and my dad only has gluten-free products yeah, in his house. From finding breakfast in a gluten-free bachelor's home is pretty hard. Yeah. We could have figured something out. Um, I have a weird intolerance to eggs right now and it makes so me nauseous nice. to think about them. Um, so we're at IHOP. It's all right. We have different rules on vacation. <laughs> so we're going to run in and get some breakfast. Well, we're in Utah. So we're Okay, I'm gonna cut that out. He's being sarcastic about being in Utah. I, I'm not gonna leave that comment in. That's not appropriate. Um, so we it's are gonna. Appropriate for like. We can leave this out. Of the people. It's it's fine for us to go and have breakfast on the Sabbath, but that's what we're gonna go do. And then we have plans. We're celebrating Yom Kippur. Stop. Eve. He's being a douche right now. Let me get out of the car. Okay, get out of the car. Go get on, us, go, go get us a table. My blood sugar's getting low. I know it is. Then we're gonna go out to, well I have to go to Walmart because I need lady products. That was a fun surprise on the trip. And then my best friend has time to meet with us in a couple hours. Um, well, meet with us, I'm gonna go out to her house. Um, I haven't seen her baby since she was a baby and now she's a toddler. We just haven't had a chance the past two times I've come home to Utah to go out and see her and so we're just gonna go spend like an hour or however much time she has available for me to like hang out with her. Jason really gets along with her husband and so it's just a good time. That's who we got our Honda Pilot from and Jason's Ford from. They have a dealership here in Utah. Um, so we're gonna spend time with them and then we're gonna go to my brother's house and spend time with everyone all over again and eat all the leftovers. So, come along. For as carby as this is gonna be, that strawberry looks so good. And then I did get some eggs. I'm not gonna be able. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to eat them. Jason might. You got moons over Miami. 